Hi, these topical talks gonna show you how to fix Wi-Fi turning off automatically on iPhone. So if you are facing this error, your Wi-Fi is automatically turning off. Follow these easy steps to easily fix this problem. The first solution is we have to disable Wi-Fi assist. So go to your iPhone settings app. and tap on cellular or mobile data and here make sure to turn on cellular data option and scroll down all the way to the bottom and here you will find this Wi-Fi assist automatically use cellular data when Wi-Fi connectivity is poor so when it's uh, turned on and your cellular data is enabled if you're using a poor Wi-Fi connection, your Wi-Fi will be automatically turned off and your cellular data will be turned on. So if, if it's enabled, it may be the reason of your facing Wi-Fi automatically turning off error. So all you have to need is disable Wi-Fi assist option from here and then check the error. And the second solution is forget the wi-fi network and rejoin go to your iphone settings and tap on wi-fi tap on this info button next to the wi-fi you are using and just tap on forget this network forget now all you have to need rejoin the wi-fi and then check the issue and the third solution is simply reboot your iPhone. Sometimes rebooting or restarting your iPhone can fix this kind of issues. So go to your iPhone settings and scroll down, tap on general, scroll down all the way to the bottom and tap on shutdown. And that's how you'll be able to reboot your iPhone and then check the error. And the fourth solution is reset network settings. Go to your iPhone settings app and scroll down, tap on general, scroll down and tap on transfer or reset iPhone and tap on reset and tap on reset network settings. Once done, go to your Wi-Fi and rejoin to the Wi-Fi connection and check the error. And the last and final solution is check for iOS update. Go to your iPhone settings and scroll down, tap on general, software update and if you see any new update, new iOS update available, all you have to need update the latest iOS version and hope this will fix the error. If this video help you out, please leave a like and leave a comment down below. Thank you for watching.